Alright, we're doing some local shopping right now. This is a. Uh, I'm at this place called Long Huan Huan Yan. Uh, this place is called Wang Wang. So I'm looking for some fruits and vegetables for my place. So uh, let's take a look at some of the prices. Uh, yeah, I mean, costs. Things are going up, inflation's going up. And. Uh, oh, I want some of uh, this. Stuff. How much is this? Like 34,000 a kilo. Remember, a kilo is about 2.2 pounds. So you get about two pounds, two pounds. So, so if, you, if you want the price in pounds, you just divide by two, roughly. So if it's, you know, like 31,000 or 22,000, uh, think of it as uh, 10,000 per pound. Right. Your prices compared to what you get in your home country. And um, I'm definitely getting some of these uh, from my place. It's a lot easier to uh, to get it and then have it at home and then to go out and buy it on the streets. Now oranges, for some reason, is very expensive. It's more expensive than the than the actual watermelon. So I rather have watermelon than oranges because these are like forty nine thousand. I guess it's just uh, whatever's in season. The prices go. Now soda is not uh, this part of the world is also cheap. I like Sting. So I'm gonna get me a six pack of Sting. And I think it's only like 10,000 or something. Yeah, so I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna get that and I'm gonna get a Fanta. Uh, I, I wasn't the Sprite, but uh, I think I'm gonna get Fanta instead. So far, this is where I have my shopping. I have uh, that. Uh, the small banana is really sweet. Big banana, I got me uh, apple, uh, watermelon. Big one, another watermelon. So I'm gonna try to get me some more. I'm gonna get me some water to make ice, and I'm gonna grab maybe like some other uh, kind of juices. And you want seafood? You can get all the seafood and meat in that area. So it's like going to like uh, any grocery store. It's just the price is different, and uh, you know some prices are more expensive for certain things depending on the season. So it's whatever you want to get, it's whatever you want to get. So the prices are different for certain season, and everything's in Vietnamese. So. I'm trying to use Google Translate to uh, do it, all my translation for me. So I'm trying to give me some, some uh, juice. And I think uh, here's some of the price for some of the juice. And I'm gonna get me, uh, I think uh, something that's 100%. Oh, always try to buy stuff that's 100%. If you buy stuff that's 100%, then you know it's real juice. So I'm here to, I'll get some water. I need water to make ice. So I'm gonna get me like, uh, I think this water would be good for make ice. Aquafina. I do like for some reason uh, the San, the Sani tastes really good, and um, and then I'm gonna try to get some other uh, some other stuff. So these are like uh, kind of like milk supplements, and uh, I'm not into that stuff. But I got the juice, and I'm gonna get uh, some tea as well, but like sweet teas. Uh, these are really good. I usually like the. Uh, the Fusa tea, those are pretty good. Here are the prices. Yeah. I mean, it's a lot cheaper to buy them at the market at, in, a, in a package than it would be to buy like individually. So it's always good to go shopping and then have some in your fridge when you need it. So here's some of the prices. Like that one, like that one. I also like this one too. So I can't decide, but I'll get it something. So I got a sample of this. And I, I like, I got this flavor and that flavor and a sample of that flavor. Well, for all you like hardcore beer lover, here's how much uh, Johnny Walker will cost you. Well, for all you alcohol lover, here's how much a Jack Daniel will cost you, about 394 for that bottle. And then for the bigger bottle, 634. Some Jameson, you know. If you want like some nicer stuff, I'm more of a. Bur I, I think I would try bourbon. I like bourbons. Uh, and these are like uh, kind of whiskeys and stuff. Uh, this one's pretty good. And they're kind of expensive though. Look at that, million something. But yeah, so if you want like hardcore alcohol, they do sell them here as well. Uh, if you like vodka? The Great Goose is pretty good. Uh, bourbon, I like uh, Maker's Mark and uh, Jack Daniels. If 
you're into whiskey, here's the whiskey section. And I think that's it for their alcohol. These are like mixed mixed drinks to put in your alcohol. And these are like uh, Asian wine cooler alcohol and stuff. And these are just uh, wine bottles. But yeah, the price is pretty high. I mean, but still cheaper than what you can only get. I mean, if you, were, if you were to get like beer, I think beer would be, you know, cheaper to buy them in like, like bulk, right? So, you know, the six pack of like Tiger or something. Here's a, for one bottle is that much and then for uh, you know, the 60 pack is that much I think it's a uh, 24 pack I think that's no 6 pack it's a 6, it's a six pack so much a Corona would go for Budweiser. I like to drink the Asian beer, so uh, I go. I mean, if I was gonna drink eight beer, I would drink Asian beer. Asian beer is pretty good. Just saying. You know, I already got the other thing, but I think the, the the bottle, the plastic bottle, is cheaper than the can. The can's more expensive. I'm not, I, I'm not sure why, because maybe it's the aluminum, the way they make it. So uh, processing of it, so it costs more to buy the aluminum cans than it is to buy the bottle. So if you buy the bottle, you get a better deal. It's a good cool. I haven't tried the orange thing. I think I'll grab a six pack of this and try that one too. And then of course you got your uh, standard soda. So far, this is what I've gotten. So, uh, you know, I mean, uh, somebody threw in the beer there, but uh, yeah, I'm mostly gonna get uh, some of this noodle stuff. Uh, Tiger, and uh, Blue Cap, and 333. Gonna have to try that and see how it tastes. Uh, but I sure got a lot of stuff. And uh, I wanna take the grab car, take me home with all this stuff. So today I went shopping in this place here. It's called uh, Go Something. It's like in, it's in Govop area. And it's kind of like a grocery store, you know, kind of like a Big C or a Vinbart. Uh, but I guess it's just uh, called Go. And I got a whole bunch of stuff. As you can see here, uh, all this stuff came to like 800,000, which is about $36. But I have enough food for like a month. And uh, you know, if I was to buy this in, in the States or whatever, for cost me like maybe hundred dollars so uh you know maybe even more and so i, I think uh when you buy stuff in vietnam even though it's expensive relative to the people living here your money goes a long way and uh, you know i bought like a month's worth of food for like 36 bucks or 30 30 bucks pretty much around there eight hundred thousand, which is around that price and so uh now i have to get the grab car to put all that stuff in there i go This is the place here. I, I came to buy shopping for my grocery. It's called Go Something. Here's the location, here's the time, it's open. It's next to this big giant building. And uh, the US building. So this here. Now come here, if you're in this area, you can go between uh, like the airport or uh, whatever, and near Govop. That's where you wanna go to get your, uh, your groceries. Okay, UTBC signing off. Hopefully you guys, uh, hopefully you all enjoy this little tour of uh, grocery stores. It's, it's not a big deal, but just figure some people will like want to see how much things cost and what it looks like inside. Thank you for watching and until the next video, thanks.